Well, you're here and you're going to play. That's uh, something a little bit different here in the last couple of weeks, isn't it? Yeah, uh, excited for the opportunity here. Unfortunately for myself in this situation, I was in uh, the last couple of weeks. I didn't get a chance to draw in, but that's that's how she goes with, uh, with the emergency recall. And, uh, you know, fortunately for the guys that were banged up or feeling under the weather, they uh, they recovered and for their sake and were able to go. So uh, excited. Yeah, a great chance to play here in Toronto and I'm looking forward to the opportunity. And I know you got a chance to go back and play a little bit with the, the Lake Erie Monsters, but not, you know, being in and out of the lineup the last couple of weeks, you know, you've done it before. Are you accustomed to it, or does it kind of take its toll a little bit this late in the year? Uh, yeah, I've dealt with it quite often in uh, in my career, and, and to be honest, the, the older I've got, the more mature I've got at handling that situation. So uh, the style and type of game I bring, uh, I'm hoping it won't be too much of an adjustment just to, to get a few shifts under my belt tonight and get comfortable with the boys again, and away we go. Yeah, and you are comfortable here. That's the one thing, because you've been in this lineup uh, plenty, so it's not a shock to the system, is it? No, I'm uh, very familiar with the guys in the room and, and able to get in town uh, yesterday for a day of practice before heading out here help too. And, uh, and uh, like I said, just just excited for another chance to, to be in this league. You know, we look at the other guys that have come up from Cleveland and there's a lot of young guys here getting their first taste of the NHL and getting ready for their first taste of uh, professional hockey playoffs with the Lake Erie Monsters. As being an older guy, they're really excited about those playoffs. So what are your feelings in, in going back down there when it's over and trying to help that team to, to go deep? Yeah, anytime you get a chance to play playoff hockey, uh, whatever league you're in, it's it's exciting. It's been a while for me at the, the AHL level, but you're not going to take anything uh, wrong from that. It's it's exciting time. The team's playing playing hard and playing well as of late to close down the stretch. That's exactly what you want to do, and uh, the guys are excited. And it's uh, it's very valuable experience for especially as long, young guys moving forward to uh, to play that upper level of hockey as we all know it keeps getting ramped up uh, as you get into the playoffs. Yeah, and for you, a guy that's an older guy and not knowing from one year to the next where you might be, it's a chance for 29 other teams to see you too, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, there's always there's always opportunities, there's always somebody watching, so uh, regardless if it's tonight getting back in the league here or the, the American League playoffs moving forward there, it's a, it's a chance to ramp up your game going down the stretch, and uh, like you said, you never know who's watching.